Well, hello, and welcome to Leech News, episode 58, part one. Eugene on the side. Oh, boy. We got some tragedies. Tragedies incoming. SSJ exposed. Female Hillary Clinton predators. Mexican Andy at the border. Let's take a look. Dozens of migrants are in custody after breaking through the border wall at Borderfield State Park. Our tennis reporter, Travis Rice, he spoke to people who recorded the chaos. Good evening. Borderfield State Park closes at sundown, and just before it, some folks made a dash for the U.S. border from the other side. Oh, they crossed the wall! They crossed the border! They crossed the border! They crossed the border! Chat, they crossed the border. A run for the border caught on camera. It's crazy. I didn't know this could happen on live stream. Video shows groups of migrants breach the wall. I always see all these caravan members. I'm like, whoa, what's going on? And they all gather around. YouTuber Andy Martin was live streaming in Tijuana Thursday afternoon when it all went down. And they all have like a like a scissor and they start like cutting the fence thing off. I'm like, wait, what's going on? Mexican Andy, as he's known online, says it was shocking to witness. And then they cut it and people just start running. I'm like, why is this guy running for it? It looked painful because like one of them were like overweight. So one of them actually managed to get in. I'm like, oh, that's got to hurt. And they ran like, oh, they're all just running. Martin says the lone agent at the fence could only do so much before radioing for support. I think it did overwhelm. Well. I mean, they couldn't do anything. But then the Border Patrol had to call for backup. And they had, like, all budget, like, three ATVs or whatever they're called. They have those. I think they stopped all of them. Border Patrol says two separate groups rushed the border at the same time Thursday. Agents arrested 53 people and do not believe anyone got away. What? Good job, Andy, bro. Good footage, bro. Good interview, bro. Good stuff, bro. Yeah, I guarantee you those cameramen that were there gave them those uh, bolt cutters. Because they're not just regular scissors. You can't cut through a fencing with regular scissors. Yeah, they're all getting paid off. Looking like a big setup there. How did you get kicked out? Well... Here's here's why I, what I think, and it should be accurate, because everything makes sense. So, I believe we were kicked out because SSJ at first thought we would be a really good, good idea to have around, but I don't know what happened. Why do you, I don't know why he changed his mind within like the first three days. Um, but yeah, he just changed his mind, and then he kept telling us day by day that Ice and Jacob hate our guts and they, they want us out right not true at all i already talked to both of them uh, not, not jacob uh ice mainly but today was like the final straw i mean i'm not gonna say anything in particular um there is a clip on ib2 you guys all watch ib2 um i was hanging out with marie today all right next to you know i get back to the mansion after hanging out with marie Get the fuck off my property and don't ever come back here again. That's pretty much what happened, you know? So you guys can draw your own conclusions from that. But I don't want to talk about that. I just want to talk about us right now. I probably will make a post soon. Not, I'm not trying to, like, fucking expose the guy. I mean, I'm just going to talk about my experience with the mansion and a little bit about SSJ. But I'm not going to sit here and, like, fucking destroy the guy. Okay, so let's, I'm just gonna say it right now, um, the threat was our YouTube channel can get removed because we were filming in the house, just streaming, like we were told to do. Which um, we were current residents at, by the way. And I don't know how that's even possible, but, you know, supposedly the guy's got power, he's got connections, that's for sure. Um, simply put, he basically just said, do you know what it's like to have millions of people fucking flaming your ass all day on the internet? I can unleash that shit. That's yeah. pretty much what he said. And another one was, uh, pretty much if we were to ever, like, link up with someone, he would call them and tell them that me and my brother are scumbags. Yeah, he said, 
if you ever want to work with anyone in this world, we're just, I'm just going to tell them you're fucking scumbags, this, 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 and that's pretty, just threats, fucking threats, man. Yeah, it's just like, like, why would you even try to, in, like, you know, intrude or, like, impede on our, like, our grind? Like, we're really trying our best to you make it this a uh, dream career. What comes around goes around, right? Karma's a bitch. Alrighty, uh. Yeah, so because they had a little stream with Marie, there's your predator right there, SSJ. Brent. Not Ice Poseidon's picture, no. Brent is your predator. If he's doing that crap like he did to Hampton Brandon, ruin their careers, get him kicked off YouTube. Making up all these lies, and he's the one that needs to be stopped, obviously. Yeah. It's time to punish people like that. Stupid YouTube. Letting idiots like that run the show. Like you're doing on in your uh, staff. Idiot YouTube. Oh, my goodness. Those people need to be stopped. Those people need to be censored. Those people need to be locked away. Like Brent. And shut up. Not people who are just trying to make a career. Just trying to make it in life. Perma band, those those type of people like SSJ. Brent. Free Alex Jones. Free these Asian dudes who might be lying, but still, he's done it to Hampton Brandon, so it's already out there. It's already been exposed. Even if they are lying, just for clout or whatever, it's getting the, the knowledge out there to everybody that they're screwing over Hampton Brandon and whoever else is under... SSJ's little thumb and use a nice Poseidon to do it to back it up and say oh yeah they're terrible people oh they're just so horrible dude don't do that to people don't be a scumbag no we got some female predators that look like Hillary Clinton Incoming. Um, let's see here. Let's scope them out. Marie, do you see any girls here that would be... What about you? Do you see any girls that you would uh, enjoy? I'm going to try to introduce you to them. I think if you dressed up as like a... As like a thing, like a... Teddy bear? Like a fucking bear or something, like a little fucking stuffed animal, I think you would... I think a girl would be like, that's so cute! And like... Well, fuck, you know what I mean? Am I right or am I wrong? I didn't hear that part, but it was probably wrong. I said if I to dress up like a teddy bear. Dress him up as a, as, or like a fucking like a like a gnome or something. I think if you that's not gonna walk in. No, because like you go to some drunk girl, go to some drunk. No, 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 no. We're not like being a predator out here. Like what? Want to get him a serious date? I mean, I'm eating. What do you mean? No, we're yeah, exactly. No, not a date. I'm trying to get him. I'm trying to get him laid. You can't be like a predator and go after a drunk girl, though. That's, and the first of all, that's like, No, he's drunk, too. No, he's drunk, too. Okay, that's not how the whole, like... This is what liberal SJWs do, so I had to interrupt. They say, oh, that's so cute. And then they say, oh, you're a predator. Because you're going after a drunk girl. Get out of here with that trash. All right. Let's hear a little bit more what she has to say. What do you mean? When I go to bars, I don't go for the sober girls. What do you mean? You get drunk and you go for drunk girls. Okay, you're talking like a predator though. And like, Is that really predator? You're bad at being a wingman, bro. Oh. They can smash Kim Kardashian if he wants. Like, let's, let's take this out a different I mean, he does. God, I mean, sure, we don't want to do that. It sounds like your thing. I mean, we don't want to do that though. I mean, all right, I can. I'll go to the next uh, video with more explanation on this. Bleach News, episode 58, part one. Eugene on the scene. That girl crazy.
That's all I got to say. She's a wacky SJW.